Hi guys, this is Dan from Buckeye Sports Center. Thanks for joining us today. Extremely excited to bring you our 2024 London 2175 Pro V Sport. London Pro V Sport's been around. This is its 36th year. It's been a staple in the fishing industry. London's flagship boat. Pretty versatile from big water in the Great Lakes, inland lakes, can handle it all. This one is, like I said, going to be the 2175, so 21 feet 10 inches with a beam extremely wide of 102 inches. Plenty of space in the bow through the cockpit. With the Pro-V, it also includes Lund's IPS2 hull. If you take a look underneath, it just has added lifting strikes for increased stability and performance. Get that in the Pro-V. This is going to be Lund's blackout package. So everything is going to be blacked out with some slight gray color in it. We ordered it with our upgraded trailer, tandem axle with brakes, upgraded wheel package as well. Kind of ties it all together. As we come through the back of the boat and the exterior, we always like to order with the raised graphics, give you a little bit of a pop towards the back of the boat. We have this, this one outfitted with Mercury's new V10 Verado, 400 horsepower, gets you a Lund recognized max speed of about 61 miles an hour, so it definitely gets up and goes for you out there. We also added a Mercury Pro Kicker 15 horse, that'll take care of all your trolling needs. Nice thing about the Pro-V is the stainless steel prop always comes standard. Just gives you an added boost in performance as well. Overall, like I said, the Lund the Pro-V can handle pretty much anything you're going to throw at it. It's been a staple in the fishing industry for years. This past year in 2023, they refreshed it. So this is all going to be a wood-free construction. No wood at all on the boat. Contributes to the longevity. Makes it a little more lightweight and increased performance too. Next, we'll jump inside, take a look, take a look at what we got in the interior. All right, so now that we're in the interior of the Pro-V, you're really going to see just how much storage and just how well suited this boat is for pretty much any angler. Tons of storage, tons of space for any application, no matter what your species you like to target. So starting in the back, in the aft deck, Lund revamped it last year for 2023, added two integrated jump seats, extra seating capacity. These both flip up storage space here. This is where your crank battery is going to be for the main motor. Battery switch also under here as well. On top of the deck, they've added two spots for seat pedestals. Three out of the four seats in the cockpit can be moved and placed up there for two anglers on the back platform. In between is going to be your ski tow bar. Definitely a water sports boat too with the 400. You can pull a tube, skis, anything you want really. In between that is going to be a live well, 31 gallons, 44 inches. You can hold the biggest wall you can imagine. Tons of room for bait, a divider, included bait net as well. In front of that, they've added this little tool rack. It's going to have cup holders, space for needle nose pliers, throwing baits in here, and under that is going to be your bimini top hider. If you're not using your bimini, kind of tucks away snugly under there so you're not stepping on it, walking on it, anything like that. On the port side here, interior of the boat, this is just going to be added lockable storage, capable of housing four rods up to 10 feet long, plus just general storage space. On the opposite side, a cool feature that Lund just put out, this can be angle storage, capable of holding tackle boxes, lures, gear, anything you really need. Like I said, tons of storage space in this boat. As we come forward here to the console area, Lund new for this year came out with their more recessed dash. So this is going to be flat compared to past years where there's a little bit of a mound here. It can hold larger fish finders, it can hold dual fish finders, everything just fits a little bit more smooth in there. At the dash, general speedometers, gauges, everything fits recessed in here, a little bit smaller space that it takes up. On the right hand side, wireless phone charger, capable of expanding and holding phone of any size. Second glove box as well. Nice thing about the switches here, all your accessory switches are going to be backlit. So you, if you are out at night, low light mornings or evenings, be able to see what you're doing. It really just gives you a smooth save driving experience when you're at the actual console. I'm also a taller guy, about 6'6", six, 6'7", six, six, and I fit here comfortably with plenty of space. And then just really kind of focusing back on the storage. Lund's known for their massive glove boxes up here, lockable, watertight. Underneath both consoles too, two rollout drawers, capable of holding tackle boxes of any size, fits in there nicely, and gets out of the way too. Cup holders everywhere, just creature comforts. One little cool feature on the Pro-V is your 
lure rack. This is going to be a high-density foam. You just pop lures in there, the hot ones that day. You don't have to go back into your boxes. You can just switch out as quickly as you can. One thing about the cockpit, too, is the amount of space between the chairs. It's kind of an offset spacing, and this space between them is plenty wide. So you don't have to be turning side to side when you're walking through. The captain, co-captain, don't have to be swinging their legs. Just plenty of space. That space does continue up to the bow, and we'll jump up there next and take a look at what we got. All right, now stepping up to the bow of the boat, you can really just see how much storage and available space up front on the bow of the boat there is. Lund's known for their storage, and this is definitely a boat that exemplifies that. Starting with the center rod locker, capable of holding 18 rods, five at eight foot six, eight at 10 feet, and five more at nine foot six. Really covers your widespread application of rods you're gonna have out on you with the water. Lockable storage as well. I know rods and reels aren't cheap. Coming up to the actual bow of the boat, on your immediate port and starboard, you're going to have one section where it's going to be a cooler, the other is going to be a live well, 14 gallons, just a smaller one up front for bait, anything like that. And with all the storage in the boat, it's going to have the hydraulic opening and closing system, so nothing's going to be slammed on your fingers, it's going to close nice and easy. And the two massive storage spaces up front, housing anything you need, life jackets, the boat cover, any extra stuff you'll need throughout the day. Also gonna have their advanced water tight system from Lund, which is a bubble gasket, keeps everything safe and dry. Don't have to worry about anything getting ruined up front. One other cool feature on the Pro V is that this is gonna be a padded bow deck. Really takes some strain off your feet while you're standing up fishing all day. In the front too, you're gonna have rod storage space on the starboard side of the boat. Cargo netting up front, just keeps everything out of the way, tucks underneath dry to an extent, and along the inside of the gunnels as well is going to have dimmable LED lightings that goes the span of the boat to the aft. Pretty cool lighting system if you're out, like I said, fishing in early mornings, evenings, at night. And then we have space to mount any electronics up front. Flat mounting service for a trolling motor, a couple graphs, and of course, power receptacle system, trim switch, and a kicker stair that we've chose to add to this boat. We like to keep all of our boats for the most part in the lawn lineup. Fish finder electronics free. Anglers oftentimes like to customize their own setup, so we kind of leave it a blank canvas for you. So that kind of wraps up this boat. Thanks for joining me here. My name is Dan at Buckeye Sports Center. Thanks for taking the time to walk through my favorite of the LUM lineup. Feel free to check us out on our socials at Instagram, Facebook, and YouTube, BuckeyeSportsCenter.com.